Hello ladies and gents, this your boy Kano from the Gamer Section and I'm back with another review. For today's review is on Soccer Story for the Xbox One, PlayStation 4, Nintendo Switch, and PC. In Soccer Story, there is a group called Soccer Inc. which has closed down every local stadium, teams, and tournaments. A magic soccer ball has chosen you, so you are on a mission to bring back soccer to your community and put a team together to do so. Soccer Story's whole overall presentation is okay, but not really that impressive. Graphically, if you're looking for a realistic graphics, well, this game is not for you. It honestly reminds you of The Legend of Zelda, the first one on the NES. The music in the game feels like it's kind of sad without soccer, which I found it to be weird in a way. The audio does tend to cut out sometimes, but it's not to the point where you get annoyed in a way. When it comes to pressing start to go to the menu, it's a bit slow when it comes to the switching. Soccer Story is an action RPG style sports game where you are in the city and you go trying to play soccer again after it was taken away from you and your town. You can choose between playing as a male or female player. You don't just have to play in story mode, no, 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 no. There is an arcade mode where you can play against other teams in the game. One of the biggest aspects of Soccer Story is, in the RPG area, there are these medals that are in the game and once you get them you are able to upgrade your player from the energy to the speed of your character. Like a lot of RPG games, you do have some side quests to do, like find some pink goals to kick with the magic soccer ball, or you have to destroy some signs, just to name a few. Another point in the game is to make sure your team is right along with battling other teams in the game. Like every game, Soccer Story has its flaws. The main flaw for me about Soccer Story is that it's multiple hours of telling a story about a league being overruled by a company that wants to make sure that soccer is going, which doesn't make any sense at all. When it comes to the side missions, some of the stuff that they want us to do, well, they made it very complex and sometimes hard to find. It doesn't feel too much like an RPG type of game, even though you have to find medals in order to upgrade your character and find shoes and other things to make sure your character is up to par, but it tends to get nonchalant and boring. For that, I give Soccer Story a 3 out of 5. Thank you for tuning in to the best place for gaming and that's the gamer section. Be sure to hit the like button on the video as we are on the road to a thousand subscribers so please subscribe to the channel.